Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. It's me, your humble host, Josh, and this is The Gnome Show. Um, today, we have a short film called Whispers of Baphomet by Luxode. Let's get into it. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and... Um, all right, so yeah, that is the first, uh, the first image. Alright, boogie. Hey Grace, it's Michael, just calling to check in. Thanks again for taking care of the house, really appreciate it. And sorry I missed your call last night. Impossible to wrap my head around these time differences. Anyway, forgot to mention before I left, there's books in the pool room, I know you like to read. Feel free to make yourself at home, nice. really appreciate everything you've done. We'll see you soon. It's pretty dope. <laughs> Raided the bookstore. Plenty for you to, uh, to, to get to be distracted. Residence? Grace speaking. This looks like some villain's fucking like lair. You know, like a like there's gonna be a vampire that kinda like, you know, slinks out from from the black velvety night or like, you know, like from a hidden door or, you know. I don't know. It's just like look at that. Like that's that not only is it a nice fireplace and a nice bar, but like goddamn. I could be a villain's little lair. <laughs> oh my god. Hey. I'm sorry. I was just looking around. Just scared myself. I think Michael has rats or mice or something. Uh oh. Big. Isn't that nice of a house? Isolated. Yeah. Terrifying. Especially in a big, big place. You'd love it. How are things with you? Oh, you win. You win. Uh oh. You win. Picked it up. Okay. So, when I was in high school, I used to know a dude named Cochise. I went to Catholic high school. So, um, there were. Um, a panoply of uh, uh, personality types, uh, all lodged in two two floors. Um, I mean, it wasn't a small small school, but it was a small school. Um, but it was a nice school. Um, but uh, this guy Cochise came to school one day, and he had a necklace that had an eagle claw with an uh, I would assume is a marble like glued into its talons and I immediately didn't like it and I was like yo whatever you wherever you got that from you put it right the fuck back where you put it where you got it from and he said he got it from a nest or something I was like yeah doubly so you put that motherfucker back like you don't need that kind of bad juju hi sweetheart um I think he went and did it I think he went and put it back I, it would have been a smart idea but like you know like if Especially if it's got a symbol that you can identify. Um, or even like any jewelry. Like if that doesn't belong to you, why are you picking it up? Why are you messing with it? You know, like do you know what, like, you know what I'm saying? Like do you have authorization to go and pick things up like this? Like I realize that this is a horror film and that this might be some kind of trap card. But, um, still, like, do you go around pawing through other people's possessions? Like, you know, like, that aren't out for display. You know what I'm saying? Like, if I have, like, a, a, a shelf with things on it, you know, that are clearly there, like, yeah, okay, go ahead. Whatever. But, um, like, a necklace. Well, it was underneath the books. So, obviously, 
he wanted you to have the necklace or to have contact with it. So, like, maybe you need to wonder about your friend here. Like, you know, what his intentions are. But still. Like, all the more reason for you not to be touching things. But, horror movie this is. Let's continue. He's pretty. What? What is it? Is... What did you see? What? 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 No, oh, that's not good. We've already seen a home invasion tonight. stop all contact with that fucking necklace that you so blithely picked up. Okay. Hey babe. What's wrong? I came as soon as you rang. Are you okay? Hey. I'm sorry. I'm going crazy. It was night. I was alone. I just freaked myself out. Hey, that's okay. Mm. As long as you're okay, that's all that matters. He's like, I'm gonna get some. I don't even know what's going on with me. <laughs> I think I'm just overwhelmed from last night. Hey, look at me. There's nothing wrong with you, okay? You got me here now, and I promise everything will be all right. Yeah, it's been a rough couple of months. But we'll get through this together, okay? We have We're in this no together. idea what the last couple of months have been. Thank you. Sorry. Stop apologizing. Me. Look, it's been a rough night. I'll make us some coffee, okay? Coffee is good. Oh, God, you must have been so tired. You've been driving all night. It's not that bad. Nothing some caffeine would fix anyways. Huh. Now let's actually find where everything is. <laughs> It's always better with somebody there to distract you. Did you lose that fucking locket yet? Hey babe, I'm gonna be back. I just gotta use the bathroom, okay? See? Like, once you leave it there, you like, uh, you just, like, like, throw that thing in the fucking trash, man. Hey, where did you find that? Oh, this? Just found it in the bathroom. Just assumed you got it for me. You left it in the bathroom. Yeah. No, I must have grabbed it while I was in the pool house. 
Do you mind putting it back? That place scared the hell out of me. Yeah, sure. <clears throat> That's logical and valid move. Hey, I did shit. I, 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 it, I fucked up. Could you please go put this back? Uh, but um, I don't know. Is that even her or her friend still? Like you know, like is he gonna die now? Like who knows? Kane. Just got stumbled. Fucking creepy. Yeah, <clears throat> I, I like films like this. I take with a Call of Cthulhu lens. You know, like you are uh, dealing with entities that you, in your world, or at least in the cinematic world, where that we're peering into. Um, they may not know, or, you know, they may not, they'd be like most people in the regular world that don't know who or what Baphomet is. Um, so like, you know, it's quite plausible that they would have no idea what they're stumbling into. Although like whether it's a rosary or a five-pointed star or a uh, like whatever symbol like you should probably leave it where it is if it's in a specific spot you know what I'm saying not like you know what I'm saying like you know you can tell when something's carelessly put somewhere and when something has been deliberately placed you should probably leave them there uh, unless like you it you did specifically for you like you know like hey I left that there for you please uh, and, and even then in the call of Cthulhu may, uh, uh, mythos you you maybe may, maybe not not do not do that you, you just leave it where the fuck it is um, or uh, at the very least pick it up with a pair of fucking tongs put it in a bag and uh and and transport it to somebody that knows what the fuck it is um yeah looks good do you want to talk about what happened i told you it's I nothing she was going to do that you, like, you're just hearing things for real for the love of yeah. god came Open up What's to that? me. You've been acting really strange ever since you got here. Do you even want to be here? Do you want to leave? Stop it. Everything's fine. Do you want me to leave? No. You can't leave. What? Look, I'm just tired. I'm gonna have a shower and get some sleep. want to leave? Stop it. Everything's fine. Do you want me to leave? No. You can't leave. Oh, that you. What? Look. That was a red flag. 
You can't leave. Just tired. I'm gonna have a shower and get some sleep. King Coltis, man. Ooh, watch out for that motherfucker. I'd never turn my back on that motherfucker. Oh, hell no. And you just... so disappointed. What? Yeah, I told you Your boss, here. Michael, thought you would have been a great host. off in the comments it's uh it's like that other movie uh that came out in the theaters a little while ago um where it was about another another um uh, old god um demon prince whatever you want to call them um Nine Kings of Hell. Uh, there, there's, there's, there's all. I don't know which one. Um, they were that one was, uh, but uh, we've run into Mammon and we've run into Baphomet now, and um, <clears throat> and I think at some points we've run into uh, the King in Yellow as well. All right, like, subscribe, and share, guys. Um, I will see you in the next one.